Hi guys, after a very long time, today's topic is immunoglobulin G. More than 95% of the drug is composed of immunoglobulin G, as the name suggested. The indications are GBS, Golan Valley Syndrome, CIDP, ITP, Human Thrombocytopenic Papyrrha, Kawasaki disease, myocarditis, and in case of severe uh, neonatal sepsis, we can use IVIG. Some other important indications are primary immunodeficiency, multiple motor neuropathy, pure red cell aplasia, autoimmune hemolytic anemia, and so many other conditions. During IVIG transfusion, we have to monitor the hiatus. There are some side effects of IVIG, skin rash, fever, anaphylaxis. So, we have to monitor the fighters. So, that's all about the IVIG. See you in next video. Tata.